Tuesday will bring something so unique to our skies, we won't see it again for another three years. CBS 17 Storm Team Meteorologist Rachel Dunzing tells us about the total lunar eclipse. Early Tuesday morning, look up for a celestial show. A total lunar eclipse will grace our skies, but you'll probably have to set an alarm. The main action starts when the moon moves into Earth's umbral shadow. That's that dark inner shadow. And that's the partial eclipse. And that starts at 4.09 a.m. Eastern, um, Tuesday, November 8th, Election Day. Dr. Amy Sale with the Moorhead Planetarium says the best thing about a lunar eclipse, you don't need any special glasses or telescopes to see it. Just yourself and a good view of the sky. So what causes a lunar eclipse? A lunar eclipse happens when the full moon passes passes into Earth's shadow. So the lineup is sun, Earth, moon. And when the moon moves into the Earth's darkest shadow just after 4 a.m. is when the moon starts to turn red. But, but the color depends on what's in Earth's atmosphere during that particular eclipse. So sometimes it looks more red, sometimes more orange, sometimes more brown. So You'll have to just get up early Tuesday morning if you want to find out. With the time change, the sky gets brighter early in the morning. So total eclipse, when the moon looks the most red, might not be as vibrant. But every eclipse is worth seeing, even if only to remind us we're part of something bigger. You can really get a sense that we live in a solar system with these massive moving objects. And you really get a feel for that when you observe an eclipse. Meteorologist Rachel Dunzing, CBS 17.